All right, now, ladies and gentlemen, we're back. I have an email, another email from one of my uh, viewers, John Italia, and it says this. Um, oh, is this all one? This is one of the best videos on YouTube about approach anxiety. I never thought about her comfort during the approach. Laugh out loud. Well, you should. How selfish of me. Thanks, Arash. You're welcome. I know indirect game is more artistic than direct. Okay? But do you think I should go direct when a girl I've never met before is eye fucking me and smiling as we walk past each other? After I started peacocking, I'm getting these looks. Good. I'm glad you're peacocking and you see now why it works. It's a great question. She's eye fucking you, walking past you, smiling. Should you go direct? Okay. I tell you what. Let's not think direct or indirect. Let's think that she's, you can assume attraction if she does that. What you don't want to do is right away start uh, indicating your interest by, so what's your name? Okay, you can say hi, smile back, lean back, wait for her. If she smiles and says hi and stops, now you can move in into what? You can go to A2, DHV yourself, okay? Uh, uh, how would you do that? Well, walking by, she smiles, smile, we're looking at each other. I go, hello? And she says, hi. And I say, um, look just like my little sister. She'll laugh, play with her hair, it's an IOI. What do you mean? Or, look just like my cousin. For a moment, I thought you were my cousin. My God. Or whatever. It's not, and, and you are already demonstrating interest by talking to her, right? But remember, she's giving you a pretty heavy indicator of interest, too. What you don't want to do is this. She walks by. Hi, what's your name? Relax, dude. Relax. Let her chase a little bit, okay? You got to keep in mind that she's got to be coming after you throughout, right? If the indicator is so strong, I might go right. If I have immediate attraction, right? I can feel it. I walk in. She's eye fucking the shit out of me, smiling, call, calls me over. Or I just walk over to her. I'll walk over and I'll qualify right away. Walk up, smile, again lean back and say, Hello, she says hi. I say, um, Well, you seem different. Tell me about you. See that? That's strong. She's been eye fucking me. She wants me. I walk up instead of like being all Google eyed about it. I'm curious now. You seem different. Tell me about you. She says, Oh, what do you mean? You know, what am I. Uh, I'm here with my friends and blah. Yeah, there's a, a lot of people here, a lot of attractive people. Tell me about you. There seems something different. Uh, there's a uniqueness or I don't know. You comment on some shit like that, okay? What you don't want to do is you don't want to express interest too much, okay? You can give a little bit, okay? And the reason why I said let's not think direct or indirect because some people think direct is you walk up saying, hi, I just noticed you. You know, do you have a, a boyfriend or you're so beautiful or shit like that? That's just not even direct or indirect. That's just shitty. That's a shitty game. How, she's not going to be attracted to a guy like that. You know what I mean? She puts you in a weird category. She might, she might not. I don't want to get lucky. I want to have skill. So skill says this. You got to, if she's showing you an indicator of interest, and if you're sure, if you're sure it's very heavy indicator of interest, you qualify her. Period. You go to A3. Okay? And if you do that, then one of two things is going to happen. She's either not going to um, respond correctly, like, she goes, I don't know, makes them different or whatever. Then you need to go back to A2, neg, and DHV. This is Mystery's method, right? And create the attraction. The attraction wasn't strong enough, right? So now you can calibrate back. Or she'll start playing the game, answer your A3 question, which is qualification, starts playing along, you qualify for her, saying, you know, that's really cool. Your personality is pretty kick ass, actually. I noticed you and blah blah blah, but I see that you're more than just looks, and that's that's kind of nice, a little refreshing actually. Okay, boom, and you now are past a three attractions already. Soon you can go into comfort. Okay, so I hope that answers it. Don't think direct, indirect. All game is indirect. It's like saying the art of war. Is it direct or indirect? Okay, read the first sentence in the art of war. The art of war is the art of deception. So no matter what, even if you go right up to the guy and run up to him and punch him, in the end, the art of war is the art of deception. Okay. Magic is the art of uh, misdirection. These are all very related things, right? And art of pickup, it's not about direct. It's about this is how you pick chicks up, okay? You get them to feel a certain emotion, to want you, and continue that interaction and move them along a certain designated path that makes them 
attractive, more comfortable, and ready to seduce. Okay? I hope this helps. Keep it coming, man. It sounds like you're winning and doing better than before, so I'm excited. I can't wait till you send me some girls my way as a package. Yes, I accept. Okay? Make sure they're hot, though. Nines and tens. I don't want eights. 8.5, no good. Nines and tens. All right? Check out seductiveinstinct.com. Hope life is good. What am I doing with this phone? I'm handing it over to the side of the camera. Okay, peace. I'm on to the next one, on to the next one.